What up, guys? It's Jughead82. And I just want to say to all you guys that, you know, get video games and play video games, you know that sometimes you need change to buy a game. Didn't mean to rhyme, but it did. But the one thing uh, that kind of screwles my scrutal, I said that, is the fact that some games that come out from back in the day, they can be really good games. You know, you got Call of Duty, Black Ops 2. Still, people play this game to this day. They even have a, a thing called Black Ops 2 uh, Plutonium. I like my Call of Duties. And even games like this, you know, this game was not well received uh, because, you know, it, it, uh, it's a wrestling game. I like wrestling games. But what I want to talk about is this right here. As you can see, I'm on uh, Steam. And now uh, we're looking at the uh, Steam library for Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Now, it's got positive reviews and everything. You know, this is one of the best Call of Duty games. But this is where I go to why. This game is priced at $59.99, and that's just the game itself. No add-ons, none of that. The release date for Call of Duty Black Ops 2 was November 12, 2012. I repeat, November 12, 2012. Eight years ago. And they still priced this freaking game at $59.99. Are you kidding me and then if you want the deluxe edition $79.99 and don't even get it started with the bundle you're paying a hundred freaking dollars for an eight-year-old game now I know what you're saying man the play PSN is the yeah PSN is still charging pretty much full price so the question is is why now on the internet I went on GameStop this is $19.99 for Black Ops 2. Now, don't get me wrong. That's probably still pricey. You can actually find this game in many spots. If you look on eBay, maybe you can find it for even cheaper than $19.99. But it's still cheap. It's still cheaper than what you would be paying if you were to get this game. Steam. Why? And PSN, all this shit. What the fuck? We got the, like, the newer systems out now. And you guys are still over fucking people on their fucking money why would you sell a game that's eight plus years old to people for so much freaking money a change needs to happen people and we need to make a petition stop overpricing or keeping games priced high for old games but this is my rant this is jugged 82 signing off